I wanted to share what I just experienced with you all in this dream. I just want to thank the Lord for this dream. You all, since I've given my life back to the Lord, I've been trying to do my first works over again. Rebaptism, you know, everything. And I've been asking the Lord to please baptize me in the Holy Spirit again and fire with evidence of speaking in tongues. And it's a verse in the Bible where Jesus says, unless ye eat of the bread of my body and drink of this cup, ye have no power in you. Something like that in the, in the word. You can look it up on the internet. Just type in a bit of it. And the whole scripture should pop up. And so today I was listening to a, a woman, a prophetess and minister. And she was praying. She said, even if you're backslidden, God is going to give you a double anointing. And um, that really helped me a lot when she said that. And she said, take your communion first before you listen to her prayer to be baptized in the Holy Spirit. So that's when I took that trip to Walmart today and um I uh I got the grape juice and the crackers and I um did as she said and I did it in remembrance of the Lord and and I um Sometimes we think that God doesn't see those things, but he does. I got on my face and I just asked the Lord to forgive me. I don't want to be in trouble with him. Like, I don't want to ever disappoint him ever again. I'm weak in some areas. I need his help. And I came and I listened to the rest of her video. I listened to the prayer again and I was falling asleep. And when I was falling asleep, I kept going in and out of the prayer. I was going in and out of the prayer. And then I finally just, I paused it so I could just fall asleep because I'm tired. And it's kind of like I was still in that frame of mind. In the dream, I was riding in a van. I was sitting in the back seat and I just felt relaxed you know I wasn't driving anymore it was three people in the van with me and it was nighttime and I just felt so peaceful and next thing I know I actually realized what song was playing on the on the radio and the song was Holy Spirit fill me again Holy Spirit, fill me again. It was so beautiful. I was like, I love this song. Then I remember, oh yeah, this is what I've been asking for. This is what I've been praying for. And I just let the Holy Spirit just cover me and and begin to fill me. And all of a sudden, the sky became clear and I could see all the stars. And I said, Oh my, you know, I was like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. And I saw a calendar, it looked like 12 months. I could see all the days of the year and all this, I could see the sky behind the calendar and the sky was filled with stars. And, um, you know, because when we look at the sky, I don't think we see stars like we used to, at least that's what I feel, you know. And um, I'm sure this is symbolic. And when I looked up, it's like the song just, I felt the Holy Spirit just cover over me and begin to fill me. And I saw the sky go clear and the sky looked just so beautiful because I could see all the stars and then I saw a calendar. And it was like, I saw like flowers in the beginning of the year and flowers at the end of the year. And it just was so beautiful but but be, I began to become afraid because I do fear the Lord and I was just like Lord I don't want to mess up Lord I don't want to mess up I don't want to mess up Lord I don't want to mess up and then I woke up 
I literally just had this dream. And the song was just, I wish I could sing it and give it justice, but the melody was, Holy Spirit, fill me again. Holy Spirit, fill me again. I don't want to make up any words so I know that the part where I'm humming it or just letting the melody come out it was words but I can't remember the words but I was like wow this is what I've been praying for this is what I've been praying for and um even fasting on a couple of occasions on a few occasions for and seeking the Lord and deliverance and just you know, read, trying to condition my thinking and I ask the Lord to cleanse my subconscious and cleanse my conscience and purify my heart that I will be in use for the kingdom of God, that I will bring glory to his name and um, and just do right by him. And, and, and the Lord just gave me that very encouraging dream and I wanted to share it with you all. God bless.